made in the house a pity legend writing up your day drop by for a while now that we about to slay i'll be sure to help you smile help you through your tough days let us break bread together discuss ways how to be effective be life changes capture our blessings one day at a time later let's go and share our fantastic lessons hey i pay it forward changing people's lives with one act of random kindness hey it's time for a roll call who's beside us who was with me i need to hit you holler holler if you hit me holler if you hit me holler if you hit me holler holler if you hear me holler if you hit me holler if you hear me holler hey 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 yo my life changers how you doing <laughs> How you be? This is your girl. Y'all know who I am. This is your girl, Penny Legend. Yes, I'm in the building. I'm happy and I'm excited. I'm excited to be in the land of the living. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. <laughs> Let us pray for the food get cold. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for a beautiful day filled with possibilities and opportunities. Father, even though it's uh, raining and cloudy outside, it's still a beautiful day. Because the weather do not determine whether it's a beautiful day. It's just that a beautiful day because you are who you are and you have blessed us with another day of life, even in the midst of a pandemic, and we don't take it for granted. Father, I ask that you would bless this food. I ask that you would bless the hands that prepared it and that you would pour back in them a hundredfold. Father, I ask that you would take any impurities out and put uh, nothing but love. And I ask that you would go into my life changes home and find that home abundantly blessed and filled with overflow. Father, I ask that you would keep our leaders strong. Father, I ask that you would just keep us. And I thank you that we celebrate and thank you uh, for the beautiful days that are ahead of us, Father, because <clears throat> better days are coming if we just hold on and trust your pro process. And we just thank you in advance for it, Father. And we'll be so careful to give you all the praise and glory in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Yes, yes, yes. So I got an opportunity uh, yesterday to um, celebrate my daughter's birthday. And I took her out, uh, you know, I pampered her and I got um, some Jamaican place from my other um, Jamaica spot. Uh, I'm gonna um, put the name, it's Caribbean Supreme. I'm gonna put the name and the information. It's um, on Annapolis Road in Maryland, if anybody's familiar with uh, Maryland trying to get this food in this picture. Why is it trying to be difficult? But anywho, <laughs> uh, yes, he's always busy. He don't want me to be great. But anyhow, um, I thank um, God for allowing me to do what I did for her uh, yesterday. Yeah, it was one for the record books. Um, I'm going to upload a, a video of it. Uh, it's probably come out before this one come out. Uh, let me see. Let's taste the food before it get cold. Uh, mm, 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 mm. I have, mm, I can tell you what happened, I'm so hungry. I had brown stew chicken, and y'all know that's one of my specialties that I make, but this didn't come from it. It's brown stew chicken. We got the, um, cabbage and carrots then we have the uh, rice and peas and we have plantains mm. so and then you know you can't have jamaican food without having gym, uh ginger beer so i'm gonna hold it up and see if y'all can see the goodness y'all see it you see it okay okay so today we're gonna have, I decided to start on doing um, Faith Friday. I'm doing this on Friday, but y'all won't see it till Saturday. But I will be doing Faith Friday, giving y'all some um, empowerment, some encouragement, you know, and whatever the Lord leads me to give to y'all on Friday, that's what I'm gonna give you. Hopefully, um, I probably have food, or I probably have a snack, or I probably have nothing. But I'm going to give you what he tell me to give you. So that's what we're going to do today. I pray that everyone is doing good. If you wanted the vaccine, I hope you had opportunity to get the vaccine. 
I'm not pushing it either way. Whatever you pray about and whatever God tell you to do, you do it. Let your conscience be your guide. Because nobody got to live in that body but you, baby. Mm-mm-mm-mm. I think maybe I'll just move this table back. Oh. I'm gonna try to see the food. I don't. <clears throat> I guess that's a little bit better. <sighs> mm -mm -mm -mm. What's the plan for the weekend? I don't really have too many things planned. I have to carry my dog to the to the vet early in the morning. And I'm gonna uh, wait till after the um, after Mother Day to get my nails done. But I'm gonna go get them done tomorrow because I don't think they're gonna wait. And um, it's not only for the women, for the women and men. It's so important that you pamper yourself, that you love on yourself. Self love is so powerful. And yeah, y'all see me eating with a plastic fork, but don't get used to it. Because they gave me this plastic fork. But normally when I'm home, I use my little, my silverware. That's what the queen do in her, in her castle. Mm, 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 mm. Let's taste some brown stew. Pickle. Mm. Mm. Ooh, it's delicious, y'all. You see, I got a small portion. I didn't want a big portion. But I know I wasn't going to eat it. I just was sitting around thinking, you know, life changes. Life is so precious. So we don't have time to be worrying about foolishness. We really don't. So if somebody hurt you, forgive them. Move on. Don't sweat that small stuff. You big, you better than that. If it's a family member or friend, let it go. Focus on you. Focus on better in your life. A lot of times, people are looking for a fight, so they always pick him. But don't give him, don't give him satisfaction. You want something different? Do something different. Let them know whatever they do don't affect you. As long as they're not causing you no bodily harm, forget them. I was raised, if you ignore ignorance, it will go away. And especially if it's on your phone, that's an easy fix. Because you can try asking my children. That's an easy fix. If you're not calling my phone, to talk positive stuff, or to be a blessing in my life, I introduce you to my friend, Mr. Clickham. I'll do it quick, because I pay that cell phone bill, and you pay your cell phone bill, or your telephone bill, whatever. If they, ain't call, if they call them with nonsense, cut them off. That dial tone works very good. Boom. They hit. Uh, they 
this all they all they tell people this car has been disconnected. <laughs> I bet you they think twice for that foolishness. Y'all know, let me tell you something. <laughs> I remember my sister, God rest my sister, so my oldest sister, I love her. But Carla knew everything about everybody. Hmm. Look at that. Woo! Burn my breath. <laughs> These girls always trying to eat. I'm telling y'all. I already reached out to somewhere. We starting a class. So I'm gonna learn about my sewing machine. I know I sew a little bit, y'all. Just a little bit. But I wanna be able to create me a bid. And then if you want any, if anybody else wants something, I'll be able to create you all a bid too. Because I don't know about y'all, but these things, they act like they're supposed to eat every time I eat. And I keep telling them, they don't have permission to be eating my food. Uninvited, so I'm getting ready to cover these girls up. They get on my nerves. I don't know about y'all ladies. Stuff always dropping down in here. Y'all don't get no food today. <laughs> Woo! I feel good. Du -du 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 like James Brown. I feel good. How about y'all? Y'all feel good today, life change? Because I do. I'm over here just having a good time. Oh, I meant to tell you. Do me a favor, y'all. If y'all like it, tell a friend. Or if you're not a, a life, a, uh, if you are not a life changer, hit that subscribe button and click the bell, so you can be notified every time I upload a video. Don't be a stranger. Let us become family. Come on. Like that. Like my videos. Comment on my videos, and I will comment. I will comment back. I love fellowshipping with my life changes. If you reach out to me, I'm gonna reach out to you. And if you show me love, I'm gonna show you love. The good book says, "Love begot love." You want love, you gotta give love. If you just want to be stuff, just want me to come and visit you, and you don't come and visit my house, you want to have a one one way relationship. That ain't good. That really ain't good. That's selfish. Selfishness is sin. Love on me the way I love on you. Tell somebody. Share my video up. Because I go to your channel and you ask me to do something. If I can, I will. That's how family work, y'all. Mm. There's so many channels that I love that are positive. What I always talk about is King E.E. E. If you if you um, get a chance, go visit his page. Big Belly Bob is is my brother and Miss Shan Shorty Recipe. I love her. My my girl, Mama Cuzzo, the essence of Sonia, real girl food world. More, I think it's more eat. There's so many out there. When I first started out, I started looking at Be Love and Lips. And I, I really love what Lips stand for, living life and positive serenity. So if you get a chance, go go visit him. He's a very positive uh, brother. And it's so important that we give back, y'all. And when I come on my channel, I do what he tell me to do. If God tell me to say this and say that, he just tell me to promote and encourage. And whether they help me or not, God is in the midst of this. God gave me this platform. So he's going to send the life changes. And yes, 
a lot of these have a lot more subscribers than I have, but that's fine. I'm still asking y'all to go and look at and support them. Because that's what it's all about. There's so many out there. See which world is a good one. There's a husband and wife team. You got Tony and Reed. My go my girl Coco Empire. My girl that strongly support me. I think it's uh, living life with Trema T R E M M I A. She support. I mean, she uh, view all majority of all my videos, and she usually be the first one to comment, and I thank her for that. So let me um. I was doing my radio blog, and God told me a lot of people don't come, so he told me he gave me a platform, so he told me to use this, so I started revamping, so I did one um, reading, and I'm going to do another one today, and since we're already 15 minutes into a video, I'm going to go ahead and read it for, because uh, you know, a lot of people don't watch your videos too long, they might not even see this, because they might... Uh, won't go 16 minutes, but you ought to, if you're going to support a person, at least look at one of their videos in, in entirety. But if I click on your video, I'm going to look at it. Because if it's drag, if, it, uh, if I'm support you, I want to hear what you have to say. But the second episode God gave me on my radio blog was titled, excuse me, y'all, Congratulations. You are pre you are already pre-approved. It says, yes, you are already pre-approved to have a victorious and successful life. Know that your credit is good with the Father, and you can only default on your payments when you lose your faith. Murmur and complain instead of rejoicing and thanking God for what He has what He has done and will continue to do for you if you trust Him. Just imagine what you can have with your credit line. He gives you joy that the world cannot take away. Y'all hear that? The world can't take it away. So if you're not being happy, it's because you gave your joy away. They can't take it. <clears throat> In John 15, 11, God says, These things I have spoken to you, that my joy may be in you, and that your joy may be full. He gives you peace that passes all understanding. He speaks about that in Philippians 4, 7, when he says, And the peace of God which passes all understanding shall keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. He will give you provision. Know that he will always provide for you. Philippians 4, 19 says, And my God, will supply all, not some, all of, of, of my needs according to his riches and glory in Christ Jesus. He promised to give you abundant life. God said, I am come that they might have life and that they might have it more abundantly. More abundantly mean to have super abundant of things. Abundant life refers to life and its abounding fullness of joy and strength for spirit, soul, and body. I can I can give you strips of reference and I can go on and on and on about the credit line you have as a child of God. Do not take my word for it. Don't take any legend word for it. Apply it for yourself. Apply for yourself. Let me tell you all you have to do is talk to your Heavenly Father about saving your soul 
and believe it and you will have salvation. The best thing about it is that it's absolutely free. Did y'all hear me? It's absolutely free. All you have to do next is to seek the kingdom. Mm, 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 mm. Seek the kingdom of God and all his righteousness. And God promised everything else will be added unto you. Believe me, God is not a man that he shall lie, neither the son of man that he shall repent. If he has said it, and it sh and <clears throat> he, had he said it, and shall he not do it, or have he spoken it, and shall he not make it good? Therefore, why don't you apply and give the life lifeline that will help you live a victorious and successful life? I challenge you to try Jesus and see that he will be the best credit line you you ever had in your life. And it, it is, you know what the best thing about it, y'all? It is accepted. It is accepted everywhere. Believe me. You do not want to leave home without this credit line. It, and the best thing about it, y'all, let me tell you, it will never decline. Never. That's the good news. You can celebrate. You can celebrate. Because what, what did I say first? You already been pre-approved. God has already put a provision in your life that you will always win. Because you, you don't have to fight the battle. All you got to do is trust him. God will fight your battles. You fight your battles on your knees. And trust that by faith, he heard what you said. And that, that, uh, that means you have to have a prayer life. Just like you sit on here and talk, if you're a content creator, or if you're looking at me, just like you talk to your, your friends, your family, talk to your Heavenly Father because he's your father. He knows what you have need of. He's just waiting to hear your beautiful voice. He loves you. He created you to praise and worship him. He said everything he created will worship him. You don't want no rocks crying out for you. You better get before him and tell him, God, I love you. Like this morning, my prayer was, I, don't, I, I didn't want to ask him for anything this morning. I just want to thank him. I thank him for allowing my 34-year-old daughter another year of life. I thank him for keeping me and waking me up this morning with a reasonable portion of my health with blood still running warm in my veins. I thank him that I got a roof over my head, food on the table, clothes on my back, shoes on my feet, and I got all my faculties. I might have a little uh, a pains, a little scars, but I'm still here, y'all. I'm still showing up. To give y'all the break bread with my life change. So I'm telling you, know that you already pre-approved. Trust the Father. Y'all know I get excited when I start talking about him. But I'm going to finish eating it. You know what? I'm going to give you about one or two minutes and I'm going to get out of your head. But I just wanted y'all to hear that. Know that you already pre-approved. So why don't you just reach out and touch the master hand. I promise you. And not only what I brought, he said in his word, he would never leave you nor forsake you. He will be with you until the end. God is so concerned about you. Do you know? He numbered the hairs on your head. That's the reason why he, he's so concerned about What person would be concerned about every string of hair on your head? Who? Let alone who would die for you? Who would give their only begotten son? <laughs> Y'all need to think about it. And who been keeping you during this pandemic? Because I know y'all been looking at the news. A lot of people didn't make it. But I'm glad I'm one of the ones who did. And so every time he opened these beautiful eyes, I'm going to give him the praise. I'm going to thank him. <clears throat> because guess what, y'all? It could have been the other way. I could have been dead and gone, sleeping in my grave. But God made the enemy behave. Oh my God, I love the ginger beer. Ah. Mm, 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 mm. I know you 
It don't look like I can really see my food, but I showed it to you earlier. And, to this, and today, it was about the food, and it really wasn't about the food. It was about me saying what God told me to say. And I never said it. So, let me eat this one last plantain, and I'm going to bid y'all farewell. <laughs> and have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful weekend. And make amazing memories. Make everlasting memories. You say, Penny, that's how can I do that in pandemic? Come on, be creative. We created. We are created. We are content creators. So you 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 can do it. When a person tell me they can't, that's because they never tried. That's the way I tell. Them. See, a lot of people can't deal with Penny Legend really. I'm not gonna pacify your your feelings, your flesh, man. I'm not gonna do that. I'm going to give you the truth. It might not sit right with you all the time, but it, it'll help you just like medicine. Trust me. Do you tell you, you know what you say? You say Penny Legend is a, a true friend. Because she don't, she, she don't lie to me to pacify my feelings. She gave me the truth because she know the truth will set me free. I'm just saying. So life changes. We already know. I need y'all to be out there being effective and efficient life changes, handling your business by changing people's lives by one act of random kindness. Truly, that is all that it takes. And so until next time, y'all know God loves you, and so do your girl Penny Legend. I bid you nothing but peace, love, and all the positive stuff. And if you have to go out, if you haven't had, if you're not fully back, vaccinated, and if you are, they still say still wear your mask if you're around a whole lot of people. But you know what to do. Do your six feet social distance. Give people their space. Don't be in their face. Unless they unless you're in your house and you know you're a part of your family, you know that they are safe. You know, the wash your God given forks. You know that. Wash them. Sanitize them. And mask up. Come on, y'all already know. Don't play. But I'm going to be out of this peace. I love you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You can tell I'm happy, y'all. Bye, y'all. Talk to you later.